So I think we're gonna go this one here. All right, I just got my Philippines driver's license and we are now at a motorbike store where we're gonna buy a cheap motorbike. So check it out. We'll get a cheap 125cc off-brand, so we're not at the Yamaha store or anything. Uh, these are around 55,000, 45,000. So I think we're gonna go this one here. How much is this one? Fifty-five thousand. Including the registration. So that, that translates to just over a thousand US, one thousand one hundred US dollars. You want to get pink? <laughs> You want to go for the pink? No, this one. <laughs> oh, the black? Okay. How much is this one? 110. 110 cc. I like this one. This kind of dark gray. Or this like matte gray color. I'm going to get You already know. Oh, did you tell them that uh, we already have our... Yeah. I said I just got just got the, the Philippine license. <laughs> so it has, it has an uh, address on it now. So these ones are 45. So for just under a thousand US dollars or just over a thousand, you can get one of these off brand motorbikes, 125 CC, 110 CC, uh, and brand new. So uh, pretty affordable uh, if you're going with the off brand. And uh, if you want to go like Yamaha or Honda, it's going to be more like 80,000, 79,000, uh, or 90,000. If you want to go for a bigger 150cc or higher, then you're going to be 100,000, 110,000, so 2,000 US dollars or more um, for one of the bigger uh, versions. But we just need it for local driving around, like uh, just going to the beach or quickly getting a couple groceries from 7-Eleven or something like that. So we don't really need uh, the, the biggest version um, or a really high-end version. Um, so yeah, we're happy with just a little one little cheap one uh, for our purposes um, so yeah we'll uh, fill out all the paperwork my <laughs> Ariel's already started on the paperwork here paperwork time I just found this chart showing all the different prices of the different types of motorbikes that they have. So you can see, let's see. So you can see like 48,000 pesos, 58, 66, 000. and then you get more serious, 103, 41,000 pesos so just like eight hundred and thirty dollars or so eight hundred twenty dollars something like that uh, for the very cheapest new one uh, but most of them are around 50 like 48 49 50 some are 60 and then there's only one that's over a hundred thousand um, this one right here So they gave us manual, warranty, and helmet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we paid for this bad boy. We're having someone come to check it out, make sure it's all good to go. Horn, turn signal, high beam, headlight, 
Star button, see beep or flashers, fuel gauge, turn signal lights, kilometers per hour, of course. All right, we just got the motorbike delivered to the house and it's time to peel off these satisfying little plastics. ASMR, let's see if we can get this one. Oh, this one doesn't look as satisfying. It's kind of like plastic wrap, not a, not that like really nice uh, tight plastic that they have on, on those like new phone screens and stuff like that. Yeah, this one's actually the opposite of satisfying because it gets stuck in the corners. That, that's a disappointment. Yeah, none of the other ones are as, uh, oh, as nice to, to peel off. All right, let's uh, start it up for the first time on our own here. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I think it goes in this direction. Turn it to the on position. Hold down the brake. Hit the button and it's on. Very quiet. See the different lights. Light up here. Oh, high beam. Oh no, that's just headlight on, and then this one here, high beam. Okay, so headlight on, high beam on, horn, turn signal. All right. <laughs> Has these kind of daylight, daytime running lights, little lights going around here. All right take it for its first maiden voyage um, to a fat belly deli down the street from us just to get some lunch but uh, there it is 55,000 pesos <laughs> 